Have you considered that the shovel might be one of our most important inventions of all time? Working the grounds might have been key to human evolution. Another tool that has been key to human evolution is the knife. It helped us prepare food and process wood. <laughs> but what if a knife and a shovel would be combined? Wouldn't that be the ultimate tool? Oh my god, yeah! the cold steel special forces shovel. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, we're trying to steal all your money, so please check out our monthly giveaway in the link in the description. Bye bye! This is the almighty Spitznet Special Forces Shovel. Made from sharpened carbon steel and hardwood handle, this is not your everyday shovel. This, my friends, is a monster. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it's so good to see ya! My name is Special Elite Double Major Dick Drizzle. My friends, they call me Double D. Today, I'm gonna show you how I survived countless wars. Yeah, tell him, boss! Tell him! Oh, shut up, Willie! Anyway, this was the item I was talking about. Here the kant van schep. Can we hear that? It is storming at this very moment. It is storming. And rain is coming. And rain is coming, so we gotta hurry up. Yeah. So, oh no, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, Mo, Mickey, this is not a regular shovel. No, it is a this very dirty shovel. It is the cold steel Spitznet Special Forces shovel. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> Spitznet. Yeah. <laughs> this is basically a shovel and a knife in one. Because it's a shovel with an edge. I am very skeptic about this. Even though we have made the video already. So, <laughs> but for this part in the video, I am still skeptical. Yeah, yeah we are so skeptic. Okay. Martin, the, gr uh, the great question is, is it a go or is it a no-no? Of course it's a go! I already said that I was gonna show you before you guys interrupted me! Yeah, you already said that he was gonna show you before you interrupted me! <laughs> Shut up, Woody! <laughs> yeah, I get it. It's because she cut off my witty, boss. <laughs> oh! For some real tests, we'll start chopping some bottles. <laughs> but sadly, Marta hasn't learned to aim since primary school. So here's a single bottle so you can see the cutting capabilities. Oh, look at that. We even took it a whole step further. Some oak. And I kinda like it. I kinda like it. Tears are running down my face. Burn that rubber like my memories. I'm a daredevil. Don't think I'm shit. And I kinda like it. I kinda like it. For the next test, Major Double D had to do something different. He started digging a Dakota fire pit. Stay safe from the enemy like he always did. A Dakota fire pit is essentially a pit under the ground. You'd make one so you don't get spotted by the enemy. It has one main hole and a secondary hole for taking air in. Hey Double D, time to make some feather sticks.
And I start to clap Cause I'm feeling good My room is empty All it has Is a guitar and a snare drum Bang on it Is this life? I guess it's fine Hey, boy, seeing your dick is making me hungry. Well, 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 well. Ladies and gentlemen, people, it is. It really has surprised me. <laughs> yeah, me too. But with, the, with the chopping water, with the splitting the wood, it was amazing. It it has no nicks, it has no dents, it is sh still straight as it was. The wood held up great. Uh, it, it is a really, a really sturdy shovel. It is not loose at all. It is not rattling and you really beat it up. I, you really beat I, it up. I split wood with it. By I the way, ladies and gentlemen, it. just to interrupt it for a little while, um, have you checked out our Patreon? We're giving away two Whoa. knives. Whoa, an amazing knife. It is a custom made Puko by Dulo. Crazy. With literally one of the best stews in the whole wide world. Sexy. And a bench made 200 Puko. Yeah? Lovely. One of the most popular lives of this moment. Join the Royal Knife Club. That's that's all you need to do. That's all we ask. Back to the shovel? Back to the shovel. Yeah, there's not really much more to say about it. Uh, I mean, even the edge held up pretty good. Of course, it has air problems, but I mean, it's a shovel. We went into the dirt with it. Yeah. If you want a good shovel, you better buy a, a good shovel. If you want a good knife, you better buy a good knife. Yeah, definitely. If you definitely. want something that is kick ass and will get yeah. you no women ever, but. Is a good shovel or knife. Yeah. This is your thing. Yeah, and I mean, even as a shovel, I mean, the sharp edges will help uh, really cut through the roots yeah, and stuff. So it definitely held up great. If you're looking at it, if you are interested already, definitely check it out. We'll put the link, I think. I think we are uh, around uh, looking like it is midnight, but we don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Bye! <laughs>